Today, I'm going to show you a brief demo of a Renesas microcontroller application, Hardy Vacuum Cleaner. Lightweight handheld vacuum cleaner powered by rechargeable batteries is very popular for quick cleaning whenever you need it. It makes cleaning easy, convenient, and effective. This part is the motor board. The MCU is RL78G1F. With the 120 degree conducting control, the Cessless BLDC motor is driven by duty directive, which uses the built-in four input selectable comparator of RL78G1F. RL78G1F can also implement overcurrent detection and PWM output forced cutoff functions by using the built-in PGA, the comparator, and the PWM OPA. This part is the power board. The cell lithium ion battery pack monitor is ISL94203. The ISL94203 monitors cell voltage, current, and temperature. It converts the cell voltages, pack current, and temperatures to 12-bit digital values to provide overcurrent protection, overvoltage protection, and undervoltage protection. It also provides cell balance control and standalone battery pack operation. Once the pack output plug or the power board is connected to the power input plug or the motor board, the system is powered on. The RL78G1F sets battery control data to the ISL94203 and the system enters stop mode. The green LED will blink every one second if the battery is not fully charged, and it will be on if the battery is fully charged. When the S2 is pressed, the system enters standard mode and the motor runs at 30,000 RPM. The green LED blinks every 0.4 seconds. When the S1 is pressed, the motor stops running. The green LED blinks every 1 second. When the S3 is pressed, the system enters power mode and the motor runs at 50,000 RPM. The green LED blinks every 0.4 seconds. When the battery voltage is low, the red LED flashes four times, and the green LED maintains the previous state. The red LED is always on when the battery is being charged. The green LED is on when the battery is fully charged. When there is no operation for 40 seconds, the system enters standby mode. Both the green LED and the red LED are off. In this mode, we need to press S1 to check the charging status if the battery is being charged. <laughs> 